Yo, what's going on guys? It's Houston Sports Step back into the video today, and today we're going to be pre previewing the Houston Rockets game 74 of the regular season. The Houston Rockets will try to win their 12th straight game tonight against the Dallas Mavericks. This will be the second meeting of the, no, the third meeting of the two teams this season. The Rockets lost the first matchup in Dallas, where the Rockets it was an in-season tournament game that was a really close game where the Rockets, honestly, in my opinion, should have won the basketball game. If they would have won, they would have made it to the in-season tournament uh, playoffs. And uh, they lost. It was like they lost by like five. It was a really close game. Maybe it was three. And then the next game, the Rockets played the Mavs without Luka Doncic, and they beat them by like 40. Look, I don't want to hear y'all beat them without Luka because we beat them by 40. Um, I don't think there was anything Luka could have done if he came in. Obviously, Luka he scored 40 before, but you know, we beat them by 40, and Rockets were playing really good basketball that night, and they were also shorthanded as well, so there's no excuses. Uh, and then now here's the third matchup tonight. The Rockets are on fire. They've won 11 straight. They've won 13 out of their last 14 matchups, and now here comes the Dallas Mavericks arguably you could say the outside of the Rockets being the hottest team in basketball next to the Rockets are the Dallas Mavericks. They're playing Greek basketball right now. They just jumped up to the sixth in the West. So yeah, this is going to be a hard matchup. Luka's going to be a hard matchup. He is a game time decision. Uh, I want Luka to be healthy every night. I really do. Uh, I love watching Luka every night, but I just hope some, you know, take the night off Luka. Yeah. It wouldn't, it wouldn't hurt you. Uh, you know, you did it. You did last time in Houston. You can do it again. Uh, Josh Green is out for the Dallas Mavericks in this game. He'll be out until April 2nd. For the Rockets, good news. Now, I don't know if this will happen, but it's, it's you know, it's it's good that it's gotten to the point where he is in a game time decision. You know, he's, he's you know, there's actually a chance for him to play. Cam Whitmore is a game time decision. We've heard and heard that he is getting near and near to a return for the Rockets. I do don't know and don't me. I don't really think this will be the time we see Cam Whitmore come back. I think maybe the next outing for the Rockets will be where we see Cam back on the floor. But I think it's a good sign that we're seeing him at least, at least it being a question mark of whether he's going to play or not. All right, starting lineups, the Rockets starting lineup. It's going to be the same starting lineup. It's been Fred Van Vliet, Jalen Green, Dylan Brooks, and Ben Thompson, Jabari Smith Jr. Uh, for the Dallas Mavericks, I'm going to try to get their starting lineup. If Luka plays, Kyrie Irving, Luka Doncic, Derek Jones Jr. Uh, they should have Daniel Gafford. If, no, I don't know. Derek Lively should be starting at center. And I don't know who they'll have at the four. Because um, you Josh Green has usually been starting for them. Uh, Josh Green would be starting for them at the three. And then Derek Jones Jr. at the four. Um, but I really... P.J. Washington at the four. Um I forgot they traded for him. So, yeah, um, let me know your thoughts on the game in the comment section, and peace out. Go Rockets.